number one in the country. Uh, not the prettiest of wins, not a blowout win as it was kind of expected to be, but it's a win, and it got Tennessee the number one in the country after beating Alabama. I, I got, I have two Rams spots here. I was just gonna say, Tennessee elevated to number one in men's basketball, first time since the Bruce Pearl era, second time I believe ever in the regular season. I could be wrong about that one. I don't know. Second time in, let's just say the second time in my lifetime that Tennessee has been ranked number one in men's, men's basketball, Augusta, smart-ass Gator. Uh, you know, it is what it is. They're number one January 22nd, 21st, 2019. I want them to be ranked number one. March, April, May, June, July, and so on, 21st, 2019. Will Tennessee make it to the Final Four? I don't know. Will Tennessee win the national championship in basketball this year? I don't know. Can they? Sure. Great veteran-led basketball team that found a way Saturday to pull out a win against a team that had no business being in that game. But they were. Alabama was in that game and, and had a very good chance to win it. In fact, if, if they made their free throws, if they made just half of the ones they missed, Alabama wins that game. But guess what? They didn't. So Tennessee wins 71-68. And also, if, if Petty doesn't go off in that game and score 30,000 points, that game's a blowout like it started to be anyway. But it wasn't. Great game by Petty, great game by Alabama, come up three points short, and that may help them later on in the year if they're on the bubble. It may not, who knows. But, like I said, Tennessee number one in men's basketball. Congratulations, Rick Barnes. Didn't see this one coming. Uh, I really didn't. I knew Tennessee would be ranked high at the beginning of the year, and they were. But I, I really didn't see us getting elevated to number one just because I didn't think we would only have one loss with the tough schedule that Tennessee's played this year so far. I thought going into SEC play, we would have two, maybe three losses. But no, this team could very well be undefeated right now. With the overtime loss to Kansas, a game most people feel they should have won. They didn't. But they are, and I can't believe I'm, they're 16 or 17 and one right now. I can't, I can't believe I can't remember that. Hey, I'm old, forgive me. But anyway, Tennessee, number one in basketball. Congratulations. Ironically, the last time Tennessee was elevated to number one, guess who they played next? Vanderbilt. Guess how that game worked out for Tennessee? Not too good. Guess who Tennessee plays next? Vanderbilt. Guess how that game's going to work out for Tennessee? It's going to work out great. We're kicking Vanderbilt's ass this week. Period.